the country radio at all, then you know the song Cruise. And these are the guys who are responsible for it. This is Florida Georgia Line, and it's Brian and Tyler sitting with me today. Um, and they've cruised into the studio because they're going to be playing soon in this area. However, for you, their new album is coming out. You guys, congratulations. Yes. Thank, Thank you very much, Robin. Robin. That is huge. We're excited. Um, now, I keep seeing from different websites and from different people who work with you guys that you're setting all kinds of records. Now, I don't know if they tell you these things or not, but what are those records? Every now and then, every now and then, uh, the one that comes to mind for me is uh, a few weeks ago we heard that our single was the first one or the uh, quickest to get the top ten on the chart since uh, 1991. Yeah. Brooks and Dunn, I think Brand New Man. Oh, look at so, you two. Yeah, so, yeah, we, asked, we asked somebody to slap us in the face immediately when we heard that. It's <laughs> yeah. pretty, pretty unreal. That is yeah. awesome. definitely awesome. Yeah. Such a such a cool thing. And now the entire album. So it's one thing to put out a song, but now an entire album's worth. For your friends who are like, I love Bruce, what can they expect on this whole album? Uh, I think more of the same. You know, it's all feel good, but uh, I think whether it's, you know, up tempo or mid tempo, I think it's something you're going to be bobbing your head to. And we kind of explored some, some real life stuff, some relationship things, and uh, we couldn't be more proud of this album. We're really excited to What's get it. What's the name out. of the album? Here's to the Good Times. Okay, now speaking of good times, you guys met in college, right? Mm -hmm. So did, did you immediately hit it off musically, or were you like, who is this baseball player dude over here? Because <laughs> you the played, guy with the cleats you right, right, right. Yeah. He, he, wore, he would wear his cleats to the concert. He plays shows know where with he his gets cleats. That from, weird. Yeah. Really? No, no, I'm kidding. No. I'm kidding. Were you involved in sports as well at college? Did you no, have to, I played some sports in high school, but I. I didn't like the early wake up practices and the uh, and the after the after uh, class practices. Sound like a true musician. Yeah, that's <laughs> yeah. wasn't my thing. So uh, <laughs> so yeah, but we we hit it off we hit it off pretty quick. We started uh, we wrote a song or two and it was like, all right, this is a. Uh, this is working out good. Let's just keep doing yeah. this and just see where see where it goes. So. You know, something just more than a little bit is working out good for these two because they're going to be opening for Jake Owen. There's more big names attached to this. Who else have you guys been? We're going to be on yeah. Luke Bryan tour next year, starting in January. So we're super excited. And I uh, love Luke Bryan. What an like, amazing dude. He's awesome, isn't he? Of all the new artists that are out there, I mean, what makes you guys different? You know, I, I think know. Our, I think our producer Joey Moy has done an, an amazing job at taking the songs that we have and, and our vision and, and really just taking it to the next level. And it's something that's fresh. It's something that, mm -hmm. that kind of sticks out. And uh, he's just taking our music to, to places that I think, you know, we never thought we'd be able to go. So uh, I think it's something different. Something I think fans are, are looking for. I think it's cool to hear what other people and other genres like to listen to. So mm -hmm. some for people who are not in... What artists do you like in other genres? <laughs> Let me ask it that yeah, way. I'm a, I'm a big Wiz Khalifa fan. I love Wiz Khalifa. Um, November 25th, son. I'll be there. We're going to Wiz Khalifa show November 25th. I'm there. sorry, that went right over my time. head. I guess yeah. I'm not a Wiz Khalifa fan. He's a big Lil Wayne fan. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, maybe that's weird, but we're, we, we, we love like him. Pop, we, yeah. our, I think our influences are kind of all over the map, and I think that's what uh, kind of separates us a little bit when we're writing. We're drawn from so many different places. So. Yeah. We hope to see so much more with this new album. And tell me again the name of it. Here's to the good times. I, I knew it was something about a party. There you go. Um, <laughs> <laughs> it is so nice to have you guys here.